you know, one of the hardest things to do is to put a crew together, to put a team of people together. You need a reason. You need a reference point. You need the context for what is going to bring this team together. Now, if you start with something that's kind of vague, like let's get some people together and let's look what their gifts are together and let's put them together once a week for some training and let's see what can happen. Now, in the military, this might be difficult, but imagine as civilians, each with their own lives, each doing what they wanna do. How do you really bring people together to learn how to work as a team based upon their actual real gifts? Nova and I are putting together a divination tool to help answer questions, to help stimulate conversations, to help you see something different, bring something new into your life. But there's only the two of us and there's other people that I'm involved in that I would like to participate. And so I invited 34 people to come into a meeting on Sunday at 10 a.m. The meeting was at four. And I wanted to see who would show up like that. Who's ready to show up? Who's waiting to show up? And so 10 people showed up and we spoke for an hour. It was quite interesting. I've been waiting to build a superhero team and to share an operating system that I've been working on for the past 25 years. But I find that people are very distracted and uh, all have their own things that they're doing. And so to pay attention to somebody who's been speaking about an idea for so long, but seemingly nothing happening can be a bit difficult in enrolling people in the idea. To create a whole new system, you need people that are willing and committed and able to build pieces of that system such that the system pieces can come together in a manner where they all work together in a holistic manner. That's the key of our future together. I know most of us wanna be on a beach somewhere, drinking a tequila, hanging out and having a good time. And believe me, Captain Sweep would like to be there perhaps in Tulum with Miss Plum. But I find in order to do the real work, sometimes you have to isolate yourself to do stuff you would never do if you're out there having fun. I'm not sure where the right place on the planet is to be, but right now we can connect to each other in Zoom from anywhere on the planet, which means the whole world has changed completely. Technology is changing the future, it is changing the now, and we're either using it to our advantage or watching other people use it to their advantage. I think it's time for the people of Canada to put our technology and knowledge and people power together to create the best nation on the planet. To do so, we have to change our entire economic system, starting at the top and how our government handles all our money. The key is the language structure that is gonna connect us together in order to do commerce in the 21st century in a good way. So we have our first super team, whether they're going to stick together or build something of consequence remains to be seen. But if you're interested in building a super team and you have 10 people and you want Captain Sweep to train you, well, get in touch with me. I'm running out of room, I'm running out of time, I'm also running out of patience. The world is not as it seems and it's time to organize. So if you see this video or any of my other videos, you might see it as a bit of a wake up call. There is a very secret plan. I am Captain Sweep, and behind the scenes, much is happening that you don't know, but you might want to 